In this video, we're going to show you how to hook up a four-wire single-speed condenser fan motor. Now, most four-wire single-speed motors are aftermarket motors, and they're very easy to install. But to do so, you're going to have to have a single capacitor. A single capacitor has two wiring terminals on top, whereas a dual, of course, has three sets of terminals on top. So if you do have a dual and you don't want to add a single to your uh, unit, what you can do is you can actually take this four-wire motor, take the brown wire with the white stripe, and just tape up the end, tape it out of the way, and then yet that will leave you with three wires, and you can watch our video how to install a three-wire AC condenser fan motor, and you can get going that way. But the four-wire, to hook up the four-wire system, you're going to need a single capacitor, and again, it's very easy to do. So we're going to take our two brown wires, one has a white stripe, one solid brown, and we're going to hook them to either side of our capacitor here. Now, when we're hooking up on this single capacitor, both ends are completely reversible. So it doesn't matter which side of the capacitor you hook it to, just one capacitor wire to one side and one capacitor wire to the other. Again, they should both be brown. And put that out of the way for now. That leaves you just with two wires left, normally a black one and a white one. What you're going to do with that is you have to hook those to your AC condenser contactor relay. You need to look at the relay and see which side the incoming high voltage wires are on. Normally the bottom, you'll have two wires coming into the bottom and connecting to an external source to power your unit. So we'll want to go to the top side of our contactor or the opposite side of the power wires. Again, when you're hooking up in a four wire system, you just hook one wire to one side of the contactor and the other wire to the other side and they are completely reversible. You could switch these two wires and it would make no difference. The only other thing you need to do is now you can turn on your unit, power it up, and make sure it rotates to the right direction. If it doesn't rotate the right direction, your universal four wire motors have little loops at the bottom of the unit. In this case, we have two yellow wires connected to each other and two orange wires. If you want to reverse the rotation, just break those wires and connect the orange to yellow and your other orange to yellow, fire it back up, and now your unit will rotate in the opposite direction. And that's all there is to hooking up a four-wire condenser fan motor as far as electronics go. So remember, at NorthAmericaHVAC.com, we have thousands of motors for all applications. And if you need help finding the motor that you need, you can drop us an email at info at NorthAmericaHVAC.com. Just give us the brand and model number of the unit that you're working with. We'll be happy to help you out and send you a direct link to the motor that you need for your unit. If you want something quicker, you can reach us at between the hours of 8 and 4 Eastern Time uh, by clicking our live chat button at the top of the screen, and an operator can help you in real time the same way that they would have helped you on an email. So, good luck with your unit, and thanks for watching.